If you want to start talking about taxes and all that, if you got that girl pregnant in California. No, I'm not worried about taxes right now. That's a different conversation than her saying, hey, I want to raise this alone and then you to support her. I saw a comment the other day and it said, do a prank getting a girl preg dot dot and she is having a baby any day now. You know what, Janine? That is a great idea. So I'm gonna do this for you, but I need a plan. And I have a plan. Kind of. All right, hear me out. One, I get a fake pregnancy photo in case any of my friends go up to my phone and want proof that I actually got a girl pregnant. Two, I fake a phone call because nobody can question a real life phone call. And three, I cry. I don't even know why I'm gonna try to pretend to cry when I can't even cry in real life. But I'm gonna try my best. Okay, the photo is pretty simple. I just go to Google, get the pregnancy test positive, download, save, boom, done. Maybe I'll even text it to myself. The second one is faking a phone call and I'm gonna need a girl voice to fake a phone call. Although, I don't really know much girls. I don't really know any girls. Yeah, I'm, damn, I'm kind of lonely. It's okay, I will do it myself. Using none other than voice memos. Baby, let's go. So now I just have to do a girl voice. <coughs> Hello? Bruh. Oh god. That's not so great. Hello? Yeah. I just wanted to tell you that uh, I'm pregnant. I wasn't ready for a child. And I just. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do because I wasn't ready for a child. And I just. <laughs> don't cry. <laughs> That's good. That's really good. That almost made me cry. All right, Janine, this one is for you. And I want the rest of you guys to comment down what you want to see in the next prank. And I will make it happen. Also, leave a like. Okay, so this is the living room. This is usually where everyone hangs out. And I'm going to be putting my camera right here under a bunch of other things. And it should be pretty hidden. So I think it's going to be fine. I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, I'm putting it right here. I'm kind of sure. But it's right here. Like this. That looks pretty. I actually can't really see the camera I mean, it works. It's pretty good. Okay, let me show you guys what it looks like so you can see how hidden this is. It's actually invisible. This is cool. Wait for them to come down and... Yeah. I'm so nervous right now. Why am I nervous? Chill out, stop, chill out. Uh, Alright. Let's go ahead and drop Okay, this is not working the way I was planning it to and they kind of just walked away from me, but <laughs> I'm gonna try again tonight, okay? They don't know what's happening, so I'm gonna try this again tonight, but we have to go to a rehearsal right now So I'm gonna try this later tonight and it might even hit harder because that's really when people are you know, just have their emotions out and stuff, so. Bro, why is it so hard? I can't, I'm like nervous right now. I'm literally shaking at it. I, I don't know why, I'm, I'm so nervous to, to break that. I literally feel like I have a kid and when oh, clearly I do not have a child. Oh, imagine if I did though. Shoot, that'd be crazy. But anyways, if you made it this far, make sure to leave a like right now, okay? I really appreciate you guys. I'm doing this for you. Love you. Actually, bro, you don't want to come help clean, bro? Oh my goodness. Yeah, Slow agent. You good, bro? Buddy, yeah. you good, bro? What's up with you, bro? Yeah. So, what are you doing just sitting there like that, bro? I don't give a. I don't know if you need anything, bro. You sure you good, buddy? Yeah. For real? 
sure, bro. Just make it sure, bro. Do that, if you're trying to do a nap, you're gonna do an ask you what you're Put the chipotle in the fridge. Yes. You guys about it before it became too like, impactful to the group, but uh, I guess I'll just have to say it. Just I, I don't know how any other way to say this, but just bear with me. Is Kane here? I'm really nervous right now. Oh, no, I I would have loved for him to be here actually. All right, but. Congratulations! Too soon, bro. My bad. Uh, Wait, so did you- is that accidental? Well, yes. I just don't know what to do right now. I don't, I'm like kind of freaking out because- Okay, I've been in the same- I'm only 20 years old now. <laughs> I've been in the same situation. No, I, 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 I had a-, I had a <laughs> Okay, if, bro, I don't know if I should take this seriously or you're kidding with me. I'm being serious. If you're being serious, then I need to know whether or not it's with the person. Is it with the person that you want to stay in contact with? Well, I've always, I've always told myself that like, if I ever did anything, it would be, or if I ever, you know, did that, I would have to, you know, face the consequences of it. You know, Absolutely, no, I'm saying here, but what I need to know is, irregardless of whether this baby you know, was with this person or not, would you have wanted to continue this relationship with this person? Well, I, I suppose if it's, it would be up to her to decide on whether she would keep it or not. No, but irregardless of all that good stuff, this person, is this someone that you want to have a relationship with? Disregarding um, any extraneous circumstances. 100% uh, I, I would want to do what's best for the kids. Yeah, well, it comes ir irregardless of the kid, is this person that you want to have a relationship with? Let's say this did not happen. Yes. Okay, the answer is yes. Second thing is how many pregnancy tests? I had a pregnancy scare before. And it, was a, it was a scare first, and then she went and visited the doctor, and it was positive. Okay, same thing happened to me. It was a scare, she went to the doctor, but the doctor said it was positive, but it ended up not being positive. So then what happened? Um, so she she told me that she wanted to <clears throat> she told me that she wanted to have the baby and all that good stuff and um, I said if you know if she's gonna have a baby I'm gonna be in that baby's life period and she it was like she wanted to raise it alone and I was like that's not happening and then we found out you know like a week later that it was a false positive two two false pregnancy tests and went to the doctor. So there's a chance that it's not true? There's a chance, but there's, you know, there's a way that you don't want to put your hope in that. You also got to figure out, number one, you know, at the end of the day, 
you know, realistically speaking, I know you have this person in your life, and I don't know if this person who is in talks with this is that person, but that's a big difference, you know. Yeah, I mean, I'm just more worried right now because all the pos all the tests that come up, I just don't want to. I'm just not ready to be dead. Yet. So at the end of the day, it's up to her. But you know that you are an adult and you have responsibilities. And and being in a, in a child's life is super important in my opinion. And I think that's the right thing to do. So what do I regardless do? of career, regardless of anything, that, that comes first. I think I was in a situation where my business was booming and I didn't want that to affect um, how I, can I, can I be the uncle for the baby? Yeah. Can I name the baby please? Can I be serious about it? Yeah, me too. I'm dead serious. I want to be Uncle Dad. I think it how, depends wait, on- Wait, wait, wait. How is this going to affect like the group? Like you, you being in the group? I don't know because I, I can't- Look, every relationship is different. I don't want to let you guys know. Talk to this person, whatever this person feels is right for, for whatever decision that she wants to make, all right? If she if she wants you in the kid's life, if you want to be in the kid's life, that's a different conversation than her saying, hey, I want to raise this alone, and then you to support her in a specific way. If you want to start talking about taxes and all that shit, if you got that girl pregnant in California... No, I'm not worried about it. Taxes right now. No, I'm not talking about taxes and stuff like that. There's no child support cap in California. Just letting you know. <laughs> Who's gonna take your like? Well, can like take your responsibilities? For what? Just like in the group. This yeah. motherfucker. I say you disappear, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this? Oh my god. <laughs> No! Oh, I thought you knew! I thought you knew! No! I was thinking you actually didn't know? No! Oh my god, bro, that's crazy! I actually thought you knew! I thought you knew! I was looking for it! I was like, I came so late, I didn't know what was going on! I was like, congratulations! Why did you tell me? I wanted to let Kane talk, bro! Because Kane didn't know anything! You should have let me say something! Kane was so beach! Kane was so funny! I had a whole thought process! I was like, I say, I say, I say, go ahead and say what you were gonna say! I was like, I was like, do I know this person first of all? <laughs> like, <laughs> bro, I was about to start learning how to cry too and everything. You look like you're crying. You look uh, real. I was about to. Bastion smiled at me a little bit because Ryan was standing right in front of the camera. <laughs> bro, Ryan, you're freaking looking at the camera the whole time. Yeah, bro. I was it. upstairs throwing up because I felt sick and I come down here now. So but like, you knew it already. No, I didn't. Maybe you were. I didn't know until y'all just revealed it right now. Oh, really? Yeah. You didn't know it at all? No. That's what I'm saying. Then why'd you. No, no, uh, Ty. It was Ty. No, look, I, I said I say nothing, but I saw it. This mother. Wait, what'd you think? I thought your idea was I want to leave That's this room. Because you're getting your own place, right? Yeah. So you're like pranking us to like no. leave. <laughs> I don't want to leave the crew. When I first saw camp, I was like, bro, this guy's staying like like the beginning of it. You wouldn't be doing that. Like I said, that's not you, bro. I'm so like, uh, all I knew way earlier today, because I was trying to film it today. Uh, Remember when I was sitting right there? Uh, yeah. I had like a whole thing planned out. I had like a fake phone call, a fake photo pregnancy. I had all sorts of different stuff planned out. I was like, that's not even necessary if we were just going to record it tonight. I was just trying to register everything. Like, I came in really late. I, my he I had a headache because I came down from throwing up. And I was like, oh shoot, Seb's crying, this is actually real. If I, if it was real, and I actually was to get someone pregnant, what would you guys think? Wow. I would say I'm surprised that Ryan could get pregnant. <laughs> but also, but also, we would all be there to support and be a good uncle. 